Good morning. Ooh, 31 minutes. I guess some time to talk, I guess. It's gonna be a wild November. Man, I don't know, it's just started off busy. I got to do my fun getaway for a couple of days with my newfound friend and then now it's going to be a lot of babysitting. Babysitting, babysitting, and more babysitting. I don't mind, except that, boy, I get tired easy, you know? And, uh, oh, Finn, my grandson, he really needs a lot of attention. Yeah. You either got to be playing, imagining, and creating something. I don't want him to sit in front of the TV the whole time I'm going to be there, you know? Oh, he does love his, like, science programs, stuff about space, and then anything about engineering. He just loves when they take things, put them together, and make them work. He loves drones, rockets. His latest is um, flying cars. So this is a big deal. He loves anything to do with technology and engineering. It's the funniest thing. He's only six years old. The other day, we were sitting on the couch. No, no, we were playing, and uh, he had this little hose that goes to one of his octonaut toys. If you don't know what an octonaut is, they're those cute little critters that uh, rescue sea creatures when they really shouldn't be interfering, but that's beside the point. Um, <clears throat> those, they go and rescue things, right? So he has this little spaceship looking like thing. They're the cutest toys, they really are. L look it up. Fisher Price had the best ones before someone else bought them out and now someone else makes them, but I like the originals and sometimes I'll go and I'll find him one and buy it. Though Maggie says that he's probably going to outgrow that this coming year. But still, I wouldn't mind getting him this one more thing. Um, it's the Gup F. And it's on Mercari. But it's $100. Brand new in the box. So cool. Never opened. Fisher Price. But anyway, so he's got this little orange hose. Bright orange hose. And... Uh, I said, oh, see if you can suck all the old out of your Aya. <laughs> all the old, old out of Aya. And um, he said, no, Aya, it can't do that. I said, well, you're an engineer. You have to invent one. And he said, well, Aya, when I grow up, though I doubt that the technology will be available, I'll try to make a machine that can suck the old out. <laughs> I said, it just has to rejuvenate cells and make them young again. That's all. I loved his thinking. He's sitting there think, contemplating it. I'm not sure the technology will be available, however. Wouldn't that be nice? The fountain of youth. Only it'll be the suction of youth. You just like stick it somewhere and, and like pull all the old cells out or, or or what if they could somehow like clean your cells or, or rejuvenate your cells or do something so that you look like you're 20 again and feel like you're 20. Oh, to have some of that energy. Oh. I'm too tired to even think about it. Okay. So this is the new and improved YouTube with ads in between. Where am I at? Four minutes. I wonder if I can keep this to seven minutes and screw them out of their revenue. They're not paying me anything. I don't care. Something would have to go viral, and even then I don't know what I'd get. It depends, I guess, on... Who picks up your videos? Well, I think just to irk YouTube, I'm going to keep it at seven minutes and see what happens. 
then I'll release another seven minute. That'll be easier on you too. You won't have to sit there all day and listen to me. So I've got lots of babies sitting and most everything has finally come in. The kids have been waiting for quite a while for their new stock to come in and oh my gosh, it is gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. Everyone was so excited and Maggie called me. She said, you've got to see this stuff. It's as good as David Yerman. And I'm like, okay. I'm throwing my clothes on. I'm coming over and I forgot my phone here. So I was without that for a... The only thing I don't like about not having a phone is driving home at night. What if I break down? I won't be able to call anyone because my phone is sitting here, plugged in. Crazy. I gotta remember my phone. Yeah. But I made it fine there and back. It just rattles a little or something. I don't know. Something not right with that van, as usual. And Mr. Mechanic has not called me back. So bad on him. And uh, vengeance is mine, saith the Lord, he will repay. So um, I'll leave it there. So, um,. Yeah, I'm just going to sip some coffee. Uh, Diet-wise, I have no idea what I'm doing anymore. Yeah, I'm just... I've got to collect myself and get my act together because the holidays are coming and I don't want to go nuts. Though I have been thinking an awful lot of cinnamon rolls. All right, it's almost seven minutes. I'm going to stop here and I will continue later. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. I don't know what the story is. You figure it out. Maybe you can get me a title. Right, bye.